Hey guys, it's me. Uh, I have another video for you, and I'm going to show you how to install Tunnel for Mac OS X 10.5 and above while running uh, Firefox 3.5 and above. Currently, I'm on 3.5.1, and so it's got uh, multi touch gestures for uh, unibody MacBook Pros and MacBooks. Uh, so, the first thing I'm going to do, click the link in the description, which will be tunnel.net. Uh, from here, you're going to hit downloads right up here at the top. And then you can click Mac OS X, and then you're gonna go and you're gonna see latest version, and it'll say 0 .0 .0 .0 0.0.50.51 uh, universal. Hit that, and just you can say open with, uh, and hit OK. You can go ahead and quit out of Firefox, and I accidentally downloaded two of them, which I forgot. So it's in your downloads or should be. So here's the application. I'll just download it to my desktop or drag it to my desktop, double click it, it'll take a few seconds for the first time opening it, but not very long at all. And you can next you're gonna go back to Firefox and from there you hit tools at the very top and go to add-ons. From here you're gonna hit get add-ons and go to the search bar and top type in proxy bar and hit enter. Uh, go to see all results. Exit out of that. And you'll see proxy bar. It'll look, have a picture like that. Uh, let me install this experimental add-on and hit add to Firefox. Uh, install. Shouldn't take long. Gonna have to hit restart Firefox and restart. Exit out of that. Don't need to reload that. And you should notice that down here you have uh, a red button and this area to type in a bunch of numbers. Now what you're gonna do is go to Tunnel and hit Mapping. And then you're gonna click 127.0.0.1 and you'll see that the host name is 127.0.0.1 so you're gonna type in 127.0.0.1 go back to it, local port is 8080. It should always be 8080 127.0.0.1 with web interface port 7999. So from there you're gonna hit colon and 8080. And you can hit enter if you want to. Um, next just go to tunnel and make sure you hit apply always uh, just to make it run. Uh, and then to actually activate it you're just gonna hit this red button which will turn it green. And then to test it you should hit enter and if it loads the web page uh, that means it's been successfully configured. So there we go. So just loaded the web page. Uh, I can bypass. You can bypass any of the proxies, uh, not any proxy, but any uh, content filters, etc. Um, so yeah, quickly disable it. You just hit the red button, and it automatically changes your settings in Firefox. Uh, so you only need to use it when you need to. You can only you only have to use it when you need to. Um, so yeah, every time you need to do that, you need to open up. Make sure you open up Tunnel, uh, otherwise it will not work. And if you don't open up Tunnel and you have this activated, you try and go to website, proxy servers, refusing connections. So that's how you do it. Uh, thank you for watching this video, and uh, watch out for more in the future.